some people who, when they do their hair, or um, when they clean up or something like that, they always have to, like, do very particular ways to make sure it works out. For me, I don't know, for some reason it's never really been so much the case. Hey guys, my name is Dave and welcome to another video. Or I guess another About Me video. Now, what inspired what I'm about to talk about is the fact that a lot of people say, like, they've asked me, why do I have this feature on me, why do I have that feature on me? So I'm just kind of talking about it, just because it's on my mind. Um, good example of this would first of all be hair. How you see my hair right now, it's untampered. I have not messed with it at all. And usually when I do, it's like, just because there's like one hair that's high, but all I have to do is like flip one hair over the other and that's it. Push it back and it's like it was before, except without the flailing upward hair stuff. Um, I don't know what it is. I've never, I rarely ever wet down my hair unless I'm taking a shower. Um, I don't really, like the facial hair, outside of trimming it so the hair is not like over my lips. I don't really tamper with it that much. This is literally what naturally grows on me. Unless it starts appearing right here, then I might tamper with that, because that just looks weird to me. But outside of that, most people, like, they say they have to meticulously make it so what their uh, appearances they're looking for is actually there. For me, this is not so much the case. Um... Why? I honestly have no idea. It's interesting to me to think about, but at the same time, a lot of people, and I don't understand this because I'm the kind of person who goes, look, you're great just the way you look, regardless. A lot of people get jealous of particular features on me. How, I guess, how my hair, even though this happens, is laid out in a way where like, it's still there. That's kind of why I don't do anything, because it, it, it looks good, in my opinion, regardless. And I think a lot of people are just, like, they've questioned why I think that way. Give it due time, and you kind of realize that I've lived on my own for long enough to where I kind of come to the terms where... Accepting how things are is a lot better than just going, it must be this way, it must be that way, it must be this way, unless absolutely necessary. In my case, it's not. Um, my appearances kind of just favor me, I guess, in another way. Or favor my mindset, I should say. My appearances favor my mindset. My eyes are another actually good example. This doesn't happen to a lot of men, but I have default long eyelashes. Personally, it has its flaws. And do I do much? No. The most I ever have to do is like this and then spread them apart from each other. But outside of that, I don't know. A lot of women, the women look better with this kind of thing. But at the same time, I mean, it's genetics. What are you going to do? And it's like, it's hair. So if you were to like trim it, they'd grow back at a, at a point, I believe, anyway. Not that I want to do that, that... First of all, it seems very meticulous, and it seems like it'd be an extremely bad idea anyway. Anyway, I don't know. Outside of head and facial stuff, clothing appearances, for example, a lot of people are very meticulous about how they go about picking certain clothes because they work the best. For me, I'm literally one of those people who'd like, okay, wear that pair of jeans, pick out a random shirt. Okay, I'm wearing this one. And I just make it work. The only time where I'm specific, particularly specific about what I wear, shirt-wise, is when I'm doing a specific type of video on my channel. But outside of that, you won't see me be picky at all. Now, the only reason I do that is just because it matches what I'm doing. That's really it. I, other than that, it really doesn't matter. Either way around, though, I don't know. I've been rambling for about five, almost five minutes about this kind of thing, and I guess it's just kind of something that came to my mind. One way or the other, I am going to leave this video here. Are you the kind of person who really is really specific and particular about what you wear, what you do? 
Or are you kind of just fluent like I am? Now, don't get me wrong, I do still care about like hygiene and stuff like that. And if it doesn't work at all, I'll change things. But outside of that, yeah, not so much the case. But what about you guys? What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Uh, if you liked what I had to say here, look, uh, make sure to push that like button and so far you can't see it anymore. For some reason I can't speak right now, aside from the gibberish that I've already said. Uh, if you really liked it, consider subscribing to the channel and click the links on the side of my head where it will take you to the playlist I have about me specifically, or a random video that you might enjoy. In the meantime, I'm going to head off. Thanks again for watching this video, everyone, and I hope to see all of you in another. Bye for now.